you know, uh, a quick video. This is uh, yet another thing that I have been asked regarding the uh, motion flow on Samsung Q8FN and Samsung Q9FN. As I said previously on my other videos, uh, I call this television a well-balanced television. And I did mention that, to me personally, the Samsung has probably one of the most smoothest motion flow opera, soap opera effect. If you love this kind of a thing, if you love soap opera effect, Samsung Q8FN and Q9FN will definitely deliver on that front. But a lot of people can't seem to figure out, hey, you know, how much of a judder and blur should I reduce? Where should I leave my judder reduction? Where should I leave my blur reduction? And uh, to me personally, I've been testing it. I've been messing around with it. I tried many variety of different options. I tried leaving my blur and judder reduction to five and five. I also tried the judder to 10 and then blur to five. I tried many different combinations. Neither one of them seemed to work the way I wanted them to work. And I came to one simple conclusion. That's leaving your motion flow set to automatic. Let the chip determine what's the best possible judder reduction and blur reduction. So that way you have a much better calculated, smoothest, so popular effect on the auto motion flow and that's what I'm using I'm using the uh, automatic motion flow uh, I'm gonna show you to you in a minute just go to the settings right here let's go to the expert settings and there it is right here uh, hold on right there I leave it on uh, automatic I have tried many different custom options I have tried leaving it at six I've been trying to do this try to do leave it at six and six but it just didn't do it for me I just didn't get that smoothness okay then I tried this I tried leaving blur at uh, eight and then judder at four that didn't work out for me either I tried leaving it at ten and then the judder at 5 and blur at 10. I tried this combination. I still wasn't satisfied. So I came to one simple conclusion. And that's leaving the auto motion to automatic. Just leave it on automatic, man. This is uh, honestly the best uh, option. Or you can try what I have tried. I tried 6 and 6. You can try that. Uh, I have tried this, leaving blur reduction to six and judder reduction to six. You can try this. Uh, this seems to work somewhat, somewhat good, but I still wasn't getting that smooth soap, soap opera effect, if you know what I mean. So, if you really want that soap opera effect, I would say just leave it on automatic. You know, that's what I have determined. Now, 6 and 6, it's still a good alternative. Uh, I would say between automatic, motion flow, and then 6 and 6, custom, judder, and blur reduction... I would go between those two. Either choose automatic or choose six and six on blur and judder. But honestly, I think you're better off with just selecting the uh, automatic motion flow. That's what I have selected. So just go to the automatic and uh, there you go, leave it there. Because this way the chip that's built inside this uh, Samsung Q8FN will determine what's the best possible motion flow option. Well, there you have it. Thank you for watching.